What's happening internet? Sean here, Mahalo.com, and in this step, I'm going to show you how to transform your hard drive by removing all the slag. Alright internet people, let's roll out. Now we're going to do a couple of simple and easy things to speed up our PC. First of these is we're going to click on the start menu, click on computer, get on the main hard drive, right click, properties, then disk cleanup. And this process could take maybe 20 seconds, maybe 5 minutes. It'll just scan the system and find all the files that we could delete to free up more space. System error memory dump files. Not necessary. And then click on OK when you have all your items selected. And right now it's just telling us we can free up 714 megs. And we'll delete the files. And there you go, we've freed up a little bit of space. Then we're going to also want to do a check disk. So just click on Tools, then you want to click on Check Now. Then we'll click on Scan and Attempt to Recover Bad Sectors. Then we'll hit Start. Now, we can't do a check disk on this drive right now because we're actually using it for Windows. So what we'll do is we'll schedule a disk check. So that means next time our computer starts, before it loads Windows, it'll check the hard drive just to check the hard drive's health and see if it can fix any problems it finds. And there you go, guys. That's just a couple real simple and easy things you can do to help speed up your PC. Now in the next step, we'll be defragmenting our hard drive, which is a really big step in speeding up your computer, so stay tuned for that one. Alright guys, and just a reminder, this video is one step in the process of elimination to finding out why your PC is running so slow. So if you just stumbled upon this video, you might want to go to step one, and that will be in the description of this video. And remember guys, you can send any of your problems to me for viruses, spyware, and PC performance that I haven't covered in this series. Just send those to requests at mahalo.com, and remember, only you can prevent spyware viruses and all that bad stuff on the internet.